All right, here today doing a quick overview for the Ford F-150 service repair manual for the years 05 to 08. So basically, I'll be giving you an overview of what this manual includes. So as I said, it's for the Ford F-150 for the years 05 to 08. So let's get into it. So right here, I'll first show you the year 05. So here's here's just a few few other uh what's included in the manual right here uh exterior lighting, four trouble codes, interior trim, mirrors, that's just little basic little things. Um so I'm clicking on four trouble codes. So as you can see here are the common here are the common codes that are usual for this year of uh, this year of F one fifty ranging from 05 and later. One thing that's best about this manual, like some some vehicles, like maybe um, older Ford Rangers, the older F-150s, these these trouble codes. Like if you have a problem um, with your four-wheel drive or anything like that, you have the most common one with the um, four-wheel drive with your four-wheel drive selector switch. It shows that uh, error code. Um, maybe your shift solenoid. And other four wheel drive error codes. So, no more guessing what the code could be or trying to Google it. This is your complete reference guide of everything you basically need right here. Okay, let's get into the good stuff here. Okay, as you can see, um, the year this manual for the years 05 to 08 covers all engines from the 4.2 to the 4.6 to the 5.4. So we'll take a look at the five. Well, go look at the uh, at the 4.2 first. And the manual shows all uh, diagrams, schematics wiring, mechanical, everything you possibly need, step-by-step uh, -step instructions, tools you might need, proper instruction on removing or any anything you possibly probably might run into this manual can help you with. It has specifications on the engine down to exact as if as if this came exactly from the factory when it was manufactured. Everything you need. Exact specifications on engine on engine specifications. So I like the Haynes manual, which is kind of vague in telling you what uh, on the problem you might be having or something you try to do. Here, as you can see, you have exact diagrams. So as you're going along, you know what what you're actually doing, and not getting along, breaking something, or 
any type of things that you you underestimated. And so that's right here is like 360 pages. That's just on a for the 4.2 engine. So I'll go through all of that. And here we have 4.6, then and a 5.4. And as you can see, range everything ranges from brake suspension. Electrical, and as I said, basically, you can look in the Haynes manual, and that man, the uh, Haynes manual, okay for basic maintenance, but it's very vague when it gets into deep mechanical issues. I said before the one best thing a lot of people whether you're, whether you have a Chevy or a Ford or whatever like that everyone runs into four wheel drive issues and can't state this enough this is a great manual for troubleshooting your four wheel drive system don't wait till in the middle of the winter time trying to figure out why your hubs are engaging your actuators and all those things So this gives you a step-by-step -step guide on diagnosing your four-wheel drive system from the from your four-wheel drive selector switch to your module gym which uh, controls the four-wheel drive all the way down to your actuator which selects from for a low, for a high, and then back to two. And whether you have locking hubs. A regular vacuum. Also, no more guessing when you're under your vehicle trying to figure out with your actuator what. Well, might that one brown wire go to every? It you have color, you have wire diagrams that tell you the colors or what it goes to, just in case you're trying to figure some. Now you might have did something wrong, or touch your harness, or anything you might be dealing with. This guy can help you. So as you can see, this 131 pages just on the four-wheel drive system itself um, you have everything from engine cooling, emission, and, uh, gen uh, engine gen uh, in general uh, ignition system for 4.2, 4.6, 5.4 as I said um, dealing with engine performance, uh, features, entertainment system, um, your entry system Exhaust. Um, here's one of the wiring diagrams. Well, wiring diagram. So as you can see, you have complete, complete drawings and diagrams for for wiring. Unlike, as I stated before, Haynes, you're looking at, they have just one, they probably have at the end of the book maybe five, uh, well, maybe around three to five pages just for you to guess to figure out which vehicle that wiring diagram goes to. 
And if you have the experience with those, many know that kind of sucks when you're trying to pinpoint a certain problem or issue you're having, and that gives you really nothing. Just basic, just basic exterior like bright lighting, headlights, that when nobody really deals with that. You need more specific. This is the diagrams for you. So, as you got 82 pages right there full of diagrams. Uh, everything dealing with uh, differential, um, your brakes, dealing with the train, gauges, headlights, HVAC system, um, dealing with your trans, power steering. Maybe you need to take your seats out of something like that, have some on that. A minute with windows, windshield wipers. We're going back getting into the year 08 now. That was 05 and later years. So it's 08. So here in 08, um, it includes the same thing. Um, you know, with brake, suspension, electrical, HVAC, differential, trans, um, also included in this, you do have the, um, the four-wheel drive diagnosed same as for 05 too, so you get everything from 05 to 08. Everything is all the same. I know most users always ask me for the four-wheel four drive manuals, and basically, that's worth it itself. Everything else is is good to have, but four-wheel drive seem to be a lot of problems people have with their trucks. Uh, most Ford trucks, older ones, even newer ones, as you know. If you take it into the Ford dealer just for them to look at it, they'll probably charge you on average maybe a one fifty two hundred something dollar charge and when it's simple things when it's simple when it's a simple diagnosis you can do it yourself. Ranging from changing your four wheel drive selector switch yourself or just ordering you an actuator, getting under your truck, changing that out, that's most of the time that's most of the problem. Because on my Ford Ranger myself, I had that issue. It was basically just my actuator changed it. System worked fine through the whole winter. So, so keep in mind some of those things before you go and empty your pockets at the uh, Ford dealership. Um, that that should pretty much wrap it up for this session and overview of the Ford F-150 repair manual for the years 05 to 08 and if you haven't seen my other video I also have um, uh, manuals for Ford Ranger 93 to 98 and also if you're looking for um, any other manuals maybe a uh, later year F-150 just just leave me a comment or you can uh, visit my Facebook or you can inbox me and ask me um, do I have that manual and thing like that. If I don't have it, I can get it for you. And all my manuals are 9.99 and under, so don't most of these other manuals people sell for 14.95 and $20 and $40, nowhere near comparative. So until next overview for the next manual, keep that money in your pocket and keep repairing.